So let's kick it off. Uh, let's take, kick off tonight's show with our fantastic duo prod improv group, uh, Mama Mucci. And we are Mama Mucci. Um, tonight we'll do some law for improv group, and we are a duo, which means we are two people. Um, and that's it. That's all we can say. Yeah. Um, tonight our. Uh, yeah, so about. we have the holiday season coming up, and we're going to have to spend a lot of time with family members, and sometimes there's some texture. So does anybody want to share, like, safe space, no one's going to tell, any family member, and like a specific quirk they have, or something that you're like, oh, God, around the holidays, why? Anybody have one? Just let it out, people. This is, a, this is, this is cathartic. Talking about politics. Talking about politics, great, okay. All right, awesome. so if I may just quickly um, give me any, any kind of dynamics, not necessarily like, uh, Party, but just dynamicism of people who talk about politics in animated. Anyway, so like parent level, grandparent level, uncle level, like what are we? Just yes. everybody? Uh, yes. Everyone. Yes. Except yes. for the baby. Okay. Except for All right. The baby. Okay. That's good. Baby. Except for the baby politics. Okay. Great. All right. All right. Thank you. Night on the hard line. <laughs> we agree to disagree. We're, we're tired of such a divisive environment. People can't like it. I mean, of course we all have different opinions, right? but sometimes you find that the opposites are true. <laughs> Sometimes you find that someone with completely different political beliefs than you can just make, just make the best yogurt. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes uh, uh, you find that someone across the aisle, uh, you know, just says the most amazing things. <laughs> Sometimes you just find that someone across the aisle from you has the best Netflix cue. <laughs> and it's all the movies that you never thought a guy would be real enough to have. Like before sunrise and before sunset. Totally do. Classics. <laughs> and um, sometimes you just stare across that aisle and you think everyone's so different, but they're not. They're just, they just, they're like you more than you can ever imagine. They're like the part of you that feels the part that you wish that you almost were, and they like, they feel that. And sometimes to, you know, you've you pulled yourself so far from, from center, you just, you know, maybe you have to take a step back and realign yourself. Sometimes you realize that whether in a country or in a couple, we're, we're stronger and we're together. Um, so it's night on the hard line. <laughs> we talk about the economy. <laughs> Hey, Chip. Hey, Susan. Chip. I put on the stools. I put on them, Chip. They are lovely stools, Susan. Thanks, Chip. You've had a lot of time to do this. I have. You know, some think divorce can be devastating, Chip. But if you look at it as an opportunity to get into woodworking, somehow you can, can try to find your way out of it. Like I said, my neighbor, Susan, will not let anything defeat her. Will not? No. no. You have done a lovely job. The cheese wall. <laughs> that is a lot of cheese. <laughs> you had to cut a lot of cheese boards to cut her that cheese. I did. I, don't, I really only eat Swiss, but I'm, I'm hoping that this will inspire me to, to explore the cheese department at Dean's Double Cup. Speaking of Swiss, this is a lovely cuckoo box. <laughs> Thank you so much. Hand carved, as it were. You know, the cuckoo just won't come out. <laughs> I think I depressed it or something. 
Not my Susan. Not my next door neighbor. Oh, Chip. Chip, sometimes it just peeks its beak out like it wants to like, check the temperature in the room and then it just retreats. I'm glad you come over. Well, I would not, uh, you know, wouldn't want to let this cheese go to waste, yeah. as it were. Yeah. Susan, what's your next project? I want to know because I want to be here to support you for it. I really appreciate that. Um, if you come over here and look out the window over mm -hmm. here. A gazebo! <laughs> I feel that as well. <laughs> You've got a lot of time and a lot of energy. Susan! You know what it is? It's just, if you want to cry, there's just, there's no better place to cry in the open air than a gazebo. <laughs> Susan, I'm getting an impression that this is what? becoming an unhealthy direction. <laughs> I don't know why you would think that! Susan! <laughs>
if the extras look like Ingmar Bergman. If we happen to live in an Ingmar you Bergman cast them. specific you set of areas. You look out for Nordic looking women and you <laughs> cast them. We live in Denmark. They are all Nordic looking. All right, well that's, I point to you. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to create a sense of jealousy in our relationship. And what was our relationship? No, I mean, no. I respect you very much as a colleague. Yeah. Right, how are we going to how are we going to get these guys to tell their friends to see this movie now? Yeah. Um, we could just be guys. Yeah. Um, <laughs> we'd really appreciate it if you have your friends see this movie. Yeah. Um, right. I know your centric. Your reason. Your your it's your. It's your. It's it is with a why it's you yours. are. It's where is your oh. <laughs> <laughs> Wives look good with those new highlights. <clears throat> yeah. Yep. I've been in there a long time. Really long time. A long time. You think they're talking about us? They are talking about us. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> they're just gossiping. Just gossiping. I mean, it's not the kind of thing we would do. It's not the kind of thing we would do. <clears throat> I would never tell you. Watches GPO almost religiously. Yeah, I, I, uh, I, I think that I, uh, I think I have an idea about what they are. Uh, they're. Uh, <coughs> they're talking about. My, my wife found my lingerie drawer. So that's. Uh, so she's a snoop. She's a snoop. Yeah. Right. Yeah. right. I mean, a man's lingerie drawer is a man's lingerie drawer. <laughs> Wait a minute. I'm sorry. You, 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 uh, you have a lingerie drawer too. <laughs> Here, everyone here has a lingerie drawer, all right? All right. You want to uh, go down to the corner and get a uh, amaretto uh, sour? <laughs> I mean, uh, only if I can tell you about my day. You can uh, share your uh, emotions with me. <laughs> yeah, I mean, uh, I mean, not that I'm <laughs> gossip or anything, but uh, I mean, I had a rough day. I, my life's getting highlights, so I can't talk Right, to her. right, so is mine. I'm uh, working my way through the new Deepak Chopra. I'd like to, uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh let's, uh, so, yeah. Okay. Yeah, we just, well, we're just we'll going to do that. Yeah, yeah. Fine. I mean, this is, what is it going to take, like five minutes? Yeah, five, ten, fifteen minutes. Yeah. Maybe two hours. <laughs> Maybe a pee appreciate it. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs>